Hello everyone. So once again, welcome you all in today's video. So today we'll talk about the Shahid Sukhdev College of Business Studies, the SSCBS, one of the best college in India with respect to the BBA program. So we'll talk in detail about eligibility criteria, paper pattern, cutoff, selection process, seat availability, fee structure, and the placement. So to get each and every detail about the SSCBS, guys, watch this video till the end. And before moving further, guys, we have launched the batches for all BBA entrance exams. If you are preparing for IP Mat, Zip Mat, SET, and PAT, CUET, Saint Xavier's, 2 jat IPCET, and all other entrance exams for 2022 or 23, even for 2021, we have launched the Crash Course program, so you can join that also. So in live classes, you will interact live with us. You will receive the books at your home. You will learn very shortcut tricks. All doubts will be solved into the live lectures. You will get access for the recorded videos, topic tests, full length mock tests. WhatsApp group will be made where you can share all your doubts. And throughout this period, you will solve around 10,000 plus questions and you will get the mentorship. So, guys, what are you waiting for? If you want to crack your respective VBA entrance exams, call 8828581455 or you can visit our website manualdo.com slash VBA entrance. So, now let's talk about the SSCBS. Okay, in detail. So it established in 1987 by the Ministry of Human Resource Development and named as the CBS, the College of Business Studies. And it was the first college which is a part of a Delhi University established in 1987, the first management college established by the MHRD. Now thereafter in 1991, the CBS was the first college in Delhi University to adopt this semester system. Thereafter, it was rechristened or the renamed as the Shahid Sukhdev College of Business Studies in 1997. So, in 1999, it became the only college in the country offer a Bachelor of the Financial Investment Analysis. And thereafter, in 2013, the BBS, the Bachelor of Business Studies, became the Bachelor of Management Studies. So, here your BMS program starts. Although it was the BBS priorly and since 2013 it became the BMS. It is again an educational platform of a diverse field of education of diverse field of careers such as the Bachelor of Business Administration. Again the SSCBS of various programs such as the Bachelor of Business Administration in Financial and Investment Analysis. It was the first program in country. Thereafter the Bachelor of Management Studies, Bachelor of Science in Computer Science Honors and postgraduate diploma in cyber security and law and it also offers various certificate programs such as the fintech digital marketing in data analytics in financial modeling and in the capital markets so guys the flagship program is nothing but the pba and the bms and it is well known institutes for these two programs if we talk about the accreditation then it is accredited by nac with a grade at four point scale and if we talk about the ranking then look at the ranking guys india today in 2020 ranked among the top best bba schools in india ranked at first place so guys this is the repo of shahid subdev college if you talk about the outlook then with respect to overall performance placed at second position in and if you talk about the NIF ranking, then it is at 57th place with respect to the top business schools. So guys, according to NIF, business schools mostly show Sari colleges MBA or master's degree provide. Karte hai, but now we are talking about the BBA program. So it is at first place in all over India. Guys, one of the best institutes in all over India with respect to the BBA program. is a good college, koi nahi milegi guys. The Shahid Sukhdev College of Business Studies. Now, this is the info about the Shahid Sukhdev College. Now, how you can enter into this particular institute? So, you have to crack the DUJAT. As it is a part of Delhi University, then DUJAT is nothing but the Delhi University Joint Admission Test. You have to give this particular test. Now, eligibility says you should pass 10 plus 2 or equivalent with 60% marks if you belong to general category and 55% if you belong to SC or ST category. Thereafter, English and Mathematics should be two subjects out of four. So that means in your 12th board, okay, out of four subjects, one should be English and other one should be Mathematics. So English and Mathematics are the compulsory subject. And because these four subjects have a certain weightage in your selection criteria too. So guys, English and Mathematics should be compulsory okay remember this now if you talk about the exam mode then it is completely online 100 questions are there for 120 minutes and marking system says plus 4 minus 1 okay so negative marking system is also there now if you talk about the section 
that all sections have the equal weightage quantitative ability reasoning and analytical ability general english business awareness and the general awareness 25 questions from each section so overall 100 questions okay guys so you have to appear for this particular exam and then only if you will clear the cutoff you will participate in the selection process round and if you will crack the cutoff with respect to this particular school this the sahih shukdev college then only you can enter into this particular college or in the Keshav Mahavidyalaya or the Delhi University itself. So, you have to fill the form on the official website of Delhi University first if you want admission into the Sahid Sukhdev College. So, your preference should be the Sahid Sukhdev College, but you form to form on the official website of Delhi University. Okay, now let's talk about the selection process criteria. So, first talk about the cutoff. Now, here I mentioned cutoff with respect to all the categories, with respect to general category. For BMS program, your ranking should be 1 to 155, okay, with respect to BBA, FIA, 2 to 140, with respect to OBC, 239 to 2817, and with respect to BBA program, 404 to 823, okay, with respect to SC, 165 to 4686, and BBA, 616 to 5285, ST, this particular, 2068 to 8013, and with respect to the BBA program, 539 to 9591. So, these all are the respective cutoff. This is about the ranking. Okay, guys. This is all India ranking. Now, you should be placed in between all these ranks according to your category to get entered into the Sahih Sukhdev College. But what about the marks? So, selection criteria consists of two parameters. First one, do that score, and it will carry 65% of weightage. And thereafter, class 12th. Academic record, it carries 35% of weightage, so overall 100. Now, out of these 100, you should score 80 plus. Then only you can enter into the Sahid Sukhdev College. Okay, guys, according to this particular stage, merit will be made. And according to your preference, you will get entered into that particular college. So, you have to score well in your 12th also and in the entrance exam also. Now, let's talk about the fee structure and the placement. So, this is the government institute, okay, and it is also part of the central university, the Delhi University. So, the fee structure is very nominate. With respect to the BMS program, for all three years, it has only 34,565. With respect to the BBA, FIA, 67,500 plus, and with respect to BSc, computer science, 79,565. So, fee structure is very nominate. Now, let's talk about the placement and it has a strong placement sale known as the CDC, the Counseling Development Sale. And it works throughout the year to build the course and to build the students. So, if you talk about the highest package, that it is 18 lakh per annum. Look at the average package, 7 lakh per annum. Top 100 got 8.7 lakh per annum ka package and top 25 got 11.7 lakh per annum ka package. If you talk about the placement statistics, 86.8% of students got the placement and look at the number of offers. 177 offers are made through all the recruiters. So guys, this is the last year data 2019 to 2020. Okay, although 2021 ka data update nahi hua hai. So once it will be uploaded, will make another video on the same okay with respect to the placement packages now tell me guys if this package mil raha hai, then what will be the roi it will gives you the best return on the investment as it is a government institute look at the fee structure and look at the placement packages so guys why not you should target this particular college and yes guys that's why it is the best pba college in india with respect to the roi with respect to the placement fee structure course faculty infrastructure everything if you talk about the infrastructure then guys wow it's great it has a hostel facilities library facilities the auditorium sport complex all the facilities it has so let's imagine if you are in sahid sukhdev college that means you will get the feeling of like you are in IIM. so if you are getting the highest package of 18 lakh per annum after three years just completing your bba or the BMS program, then guys, why you will target some of the IMs which have the same package denge, even cracking the master degree. So guys, look at this particular institutes. Let's crack for the do that and get entered into the Shahid Sukhdev College. Now, these all are the top recruiters. 
the BCG, Bain and Company, Baijus, Ernst & Young, Colgate and Palmolive, Grofers, Inmobi, Joe Stocks, Deloitte, KPMG, Genpact made several offers around 177 offers and look at the number of recruiters. The 75 recruiters visit the campus and 37 were the new recruiters. So guys, year by year, you will see there is a certain rise in the placement also because if you talk about the 2018 and 2019 data, then the highest package was 16 lakh per annum, lowest and average was 6.6 .6 lakh per annum. And look at the 2019 and 20 ka package, 18 lakh per annum ka package, and the average 7 lakh per annum ka package. So, guys, let's assume in 2021, 2021, it will give you 20 lakh per annum ka package, the highest package. So, if you are in 12th or past the 12th, let's prepare for do that and let's enter into the Shahid Sukhdev College. So, if you want a preparation, you can call on these particular numbers. Or you can also visit our website manualadu.com. For all exam updates and the notifications, you can follow our social media handles such as YouTube, Facebook, Insta, and you can also join our Telegram group. So, guys, all link I mentioned in the description. Kindly check those links and don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel Manu BB Entrance. So, because you will get a lot of updates on this particular channel. So, thank you very much, guys. All the best for your preparation. See you in the next video.